My name is Uta Barth. I'm an artist and I work primarily with photographs. My photographs look different than most photographs you see in the world. Most photographers use the camera as a sort of pointing device. And in most photographs, the subject and the content are one and the same thing. My work is always first and foremost about perception. Every body of work I make really has the same criteria. How do I get you to let go of thinking about what's depicted? My desire is to make the viewer become aware of their own perceptual process in relationship to what's hanging on the wall and to become immersed and sort of fully invested in their own perception. I was studying art in high school and I ended up in a drawing class and I wanted to make photographs as source material to draw from. But in the process of working with a camera, I found out that what I saw when I looked through the viewfinder and what I saw when I went back into the darkroom were two different things. And I realized that I wasn't terribly observant and that the camera was teaching me how to see. I've been photographing exclusively in my house for 14 years now. I decided that if I'm interested in light and perception and this visual acuity to the mundane, fleeting, ephemeral, everyday kind of information, there's no point in me going out to seek that out. The current work is a three-part project titled To Draw With Light. Instead of just being the observer, the photographer capturing something that I found, I started intervening in the scene and becoming the participant. I drew the curtains and I drew the blinds in order to manipulate the kind of shape or line that the light would cast to make different kinds of abstractions. The light is literally the medium for this work. And people are slightly puzzled by how to relate to this work because it doesn't give them any of the things that a traditional photograph would give them. They walk out of the gallery seeing differently. They pay attention to different kinds of things. They become attuned to light. I think it's phenomenal that the MacArthur Foundation gives this grant completely without strings attached. I think a lot of good things come out of failure and to have the freedom to ask questions that are very tentative kind of questions in terms of what the answers may be. It's just an incredible opportunity and I'm profoundly grateful. Mm -hmm.